here's one of many ideas for placing tweeters if you're trying to irritate a barking dog next door. This scenario may work if you live in, say, um, a patio-type home where one wall of your house butts up to someone else's yard. These little patio homes are very common in suburbs. So on the right would be your house, and on the left is your neighbor's house. And just on the edge of your house is your neighbor's yard. And right there next to your house is, well, we all know what that is. That's the dog from hell. And you know the scenario. Your neighbor is either an idiot or your neighbor does not care about anyone else and lets the dog bark all the time. So, here's one of many ideas. If you want to try ultrasonic sound to try to disturb this dog and shut him up, what about those soffit vents under the edge of your house there? Wouldn't it be terrible if you put a high-frequency piezo tweeter in one of those soffit vents with high frequencies pounding down on the dog? Or God help us if you put a tweeter in every soffit vent on that side of the house. Hey, I would never do that. If you have a noisy dog and you don't like this video, you're the one who created this problem.